they can hear the echo, look. Awesome. You can get a bigger TV than that, couldn't they? <laughs> Might as well put my mobile phone up there. <laughs> you didn't have a fridge in the cupboard before. It's very weird. They do weird stuff in China. That's where they grind all like, the vegetables and stuff down here and plants. It's all a natural uh, big wheel. <laughs> That's like the strawberries we got in um, Antenna Brewery. The strawberry wine they got. Keto chocolate for. Wow. Yeah, there's the cake. There's a few sort of uh, pastries in here as well. Strawberries everywhere, look at all those strawberries, loads of them. They seem to grow quite a lot over here in Chiang Mai. Get on the top of the hill. That was awesome. Oh, wow. Wow. Look at that. Look over there. Whoa. That's amazing. Look at that in the mountains. Check it out guys, just got to the second hotel in the Swan Eden. So Eden Eden Park, check it out, is the, the first bedroom. Obviously a little bit bigger than the other room. They've got the horrible porish concrete sort of stuff, I don't like that. But uh, yeah, nice size room anyway, nice uh, double bed. Please, please be soft, like last night just finished my back off. Oh, that's definitely better than last night. Oh yeah, that's all right, hopefully. One of the friggin' like shattered ribs from the concrete. And here we go, wow, look at this room. Oh, you can hear the echo, look. Awesome. Wow, that's not a bad size room. I'll check out the roof as well, that's wicked. Nice size for it. Wow, couldn't get a bigger TV than that, could they? <laughs> Might as well put my mobile phone up there. <laughs> oh dear. <coughs> oh, oh, kettle, kettle, what not? Where's the fridge, Dave? Um, no fridge. Don't tell me there's no fridge again. Oh, I swear it said fridge. I'll check it's on. It's in the cupboard. Yeah, maybe. We did have one. They did have a fridge in the cupboard before. It's very weird. They do weird stuff in China. No fridge in the cupboard. I have to check on uh, Eatigo, not Eatigo, I go to and check. But yeah, there's the room anyway. Look at that. Nice kettle, waters, mirror. Check out the bathroom. What's the bathroom like? Oh, it's a uh, wet room. Mum's favourite. Mum loves wet rooms. Yeah, check it out. What's up, guy? Woo! And some soap shampoo. Basic sort of toilet and everything. Heater and shower. So yeah, there you go. Not bad. It's a nice size room anyway. The ceiling, I know. The ceiling's awesome. Wicked. And we've got a nice amount of power sockets here. Check outside. Here's the view from the balcony. We've got a little balcony. You can see the, um, oh, check it out. You can see the lovely sort of garden, parky stuff. Oh, they're doing all like the um, aquaphonics and plants and everything. I can't think of the vocabulary. <laughs> I'm not sure what they're planting in here, though. That's cool. Nice. There's a football pitch over there. You can have a game of footy if you want. Yeah, we're not getting breakfast here, but look, that's a bit ridiculous. Breakfast set between 7 a.m. and 9 o'clock. How early is that? That's well, that's well early to close, isn't it? Oh no! Yeah, that's ridiculous. Really hey, what's freaking stupid though? We got like the freaking kettle. The plug, the plug is over here. We try to put it on there. It like freaking hangs over the edge like this. And when to put it on down here, it doesn't fit on there. You have to put it on the freaking stool and then on the tissue box. I've always said it don't bloody work. I mean, how stupid is that? What's the kettle there with no plug socket? <laughs> Literally have to pile it up on that. Oh dear. It's not a bad size room and everything. I say I'm not too fond of all the like the, the polished concrete, cement, whatever you call it. I say the staff again, pretty much freaking rude. I mean they just gave this key, walked off, like no, like, oh hello, welcome to the room, blah 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 blah. The Wi-Fi is here. If you want breakfast down here, there's a coffee, nothing, just here's the key, back her off. You bloody hell, you're in the freaking customer service sort of uh, business. You can have some freaking manners, it's really annoying. I can't believe it, like most people up here have been like incredibly rude. The only people that have been like pretty, pretty freaking friendly is when we're at the bloody um, petrol station and everyone was like, hello, hello, hello. I was like, come on, Chiang Mai, what the hell? You're trying to compete with like Bangkok's rudeness or something. I mean, you're probably winning at the moment. Bloody yes, check it out. So just come up the steps, like there's our room down here. Come up here, look, got a nice little sort of a uh, poolie area. Pooly area, freaking pond. Come up here. Look at that, they've got the cool sort of uh, spacey tents. Quite a few of them down here, and it comes up in this. Uh, top section up here. Looks like they sort of do a barbecue, but there's like nothing nothing going on at all out here. They've got like a few tables and chairs, but uh, yeah, it seems pretty derelict. Oh, there you go. Get a nicer view up here though. So you've got a cool football pitch, check it out. I think that's a cafe over there. I say that, oh man, on the, on the top of the hills, it's just awesome. Uh, loads of those freaking like those spacey sort of like dome tents and everything right up there. I bet they get an awesome view of the sunset. Yeah, check it out. Yeah, right up there. Look at that. How cool is that? Ten minutes later, they finally come out. I say that's where I went off a second ago. Right at the top up here, there's all the, the pondy area. No, it's loads like the, the palmy sort of uh, banana trees. Wicked. I love all of these trees. They're just so awesome. I wonder where that goes. Maybe that to the 
space sort of tents, Mum? Not sure. Yeah, cool. Just crossed the road from uh, the place we just come out down here. That's where they're growing all like the vegetables and stuff down here and plants. I'm not sure exactly what they're growing. Probably some like uh, lettucey sort of stuff, I think. It looks awesome, doesn't it? <laughs> couldn't get it quite over. Still got a bit of backache, so I couldn't get it over. There you go. The Thai natural uh, big wheel. <laughs> yeah, yeah. Ah, oh, dear. Ooh. There you go. Anyway, here's a restaurant down here. Oh, there, breathless. Eden Mon Dam. So check it out, here's probably all the, uh, the wine that they do from all the strawberry making, look. Probably from the strawberry place, look. Big bottle, 450, two bottles, 800. That's probably dry fruit as well. That's like the strawberries we got in um, Ganchenaburi. I say it's probably from the strawberry farm down the Duda, down the way, isn't it? There's some coffee, nice. I say that the wine there, the strawberry wine they got. Oh, the cakes do look pretty nice though, yeah. They must have a lot of Koreans in here, it's written in Korean. Normally you think it'd be in Chinese or Japanese. That's weird that, they had news, Korean newspaper in the other one. There you go, there's the cakes. Oh, there's a few sort of uh, pastries in there as well. Awesome. So there's the drinks and that, dessert menu. Can anyone tell me what a friggin' dirty is though? I want a friggin' clean. 90 baht for dirty. Bloody hell. <laughs> well, that's quite cool though, doesn't it? Nice, nice place to sit. Okay, we've got the closey shop here. You never guess what I just seen. Look, 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 look. No, Dark shot, look. Yeah, what's that say? The top. Oh, here. Yeah. Right there. Shoot. Look, Ben. Here. Keto. Yes. Keto. Ten minutes later. We're well, not looking. Keto chocolate bar. Wow. That's not bad. Cocoa mass, fresh coffee, monk fruit sugar. I was done sweet with monk fruit. Oh wow, that's awesome, well done shop. Nice to see in Thailand some keto stuff.